Hey y'all, Carolina Tony here. Today the road <laughs> brings me to Rapid City, South Dakota. We are here at Old Fort Hayes. Old Fort Hayes was a filming site for the 1990 movie Dancing with Wolves starring Kevin Costner. We will be going today actually on the film set. A lot of these buildings were used in the film. And we're gonna take a look around and you get to come with us. And we'll get started right after this station identification. Get up here, baby. <laughs> so this is old Fort Hayes and was the filming set for the 1990 movie starring Kevin Costner, Dances with Wolves. One of my favorite movies. Now we have found out that not everything here was used in the movie, but this particular building here was. This was the supply house in Dances with Wolves. Well, we would just have a look around and see if we can tell. Well, look, it's cowgirls. I imagine there is a bathroom. Here's a tin shop. And it looks like they actually make tin plates here. How cool is that? From these metal discs, they put them in the lathe and spit them out. There we go. These plates stamped out. Dances with Wolves, South Dakota, Fort what? Hayes. Fort Hayes, South Dakota. There's the post office. A buffalo encrusted with rocks. The ye old rope maker and blacksmith shop. A little more modern blacksmith shop. This steam engine was used in the movie Dances with Wolves. They said from 1989, perhaps that's when it was filmed. It came out in 90, I'm not sure. 89, 90. That's close enough for hand grenades and horseshoes. Nonetheless, was used in the movie. And this steam engine turns the belt that in turn turns this saw blade and saws the logs or saws the lumber. This steam engine was used in the movie Dances with Wolves. They said from 1989, perhaps that's when it was filmed, it came out in 90, I'm not sure. 89, 90. That's close enough for hand grenades and horseshoes. Nonetheless, was used in the movie. And this steam engine turns the belt that in turn turns this saw blade and saws the logs or saws the lumber. This steam engine was used in the movie Dances with Wolves. They said from 1989, perhaps that's when it was filmed, it came out in 90, I'm not sure. 89, 90. That's close enough for hand grenades and horseshoes. Nonetheless, was used in the movie. And this steam engine turns the belt that in turn turns this saw blade and saws the logs or saws the lumber. And this is the sawmill. This was in Dances with the Wolves. Part of the film set it was actually here. Thank <laughs> you. 
anyone that knows a good buddy of mine, uh, his uh, Jacob the Carpetbagger. Jacob always goes to a lot of places and he will get pressed pennies. And you know, you put 50 cent or dollar in and then put a penny in and it will press your penny. But this here is really old school. This dates back to 1892 to 1893. A different way of pressing pennies. On this thing here, this was driven by steam or in this case, an electric engine. This electric engine turns the wheel that turns the belt right here that in turns, turns this press. In this method, they would take the penny and use pliers and actually put it into the press as the wheel and belt was turning and then out would come a press penny just like this. This is really old school. Tell everybody you saw it here first. This is with wolves. Okay, so we have got our two press pennies, four haze dances with wolves. There are a lot of just old antiques around carved buffalo. A antique garden. A strange tree that has been turned upside down with ropes in it and I don't understand the whole purpose behind that. And let's look at the view out the back of the old supply store. Pretty impressive with a mountain coaster right there. Here at Old Fort Hayes they do different types of demonstrations. They do cooking on black iron and of course they make things from tin and you can actually watch them pressing pennies for you uh, and sawing wood. Uh, kind of showing people what things were like back in the old west and how people got along. It's right next to a KOA campground and you see they're right in the parking lot. Right next door to old Fort Hayes is a pretty large building. That's a gift shop but they have a Old West supper and show inside. At Old Fort Hayes, they have an attraction called the Interactive Roller Coaster, the Buffalo Hunt, and which you sit in a little car and you traverse down the rail and you hunt for buffalo. And I think there's some other animals because I see a turkey right there. And there goes some children. They're off on a buffalo hunt twisting and turning around trying to help wipe out the endangered species the buffalo of course these buffaloes are made from fiberglass well that is going to do it for our trip to old Fort Hayes the dances with wolves filming site I hope you've enjoyed this video if you did be sure to give me a big old thumbs up be sure to share this video with your family and friends and if you know anybody that's got any money they can pay bail, please send it to me. But for now, y'all have a good day.